What is up people of the internet, it's Shaggy here bringing you a quick nuclear, this isn't the best gameplay that you'll see from me obviously, but I just wanted to upload something quick and short because I'm really busy today, and I don't really have that much time to render, so I wanted to do this quick so I could have it rendered and ready to upload when I get back, or maybe even upload it while I'm gone, I'm not even sure, but I hope you guys are enjoying this quick nuclear, it's about 3 minutes, I think it's just under, um, the nuclear metal doesn't pop up right away after I get the nuclear, so I actually counted the kills one by one to find out exactly where and I didn't include that one right there I did not include that this is a suicide so it might have been the kill before but it was like a double spray at the end I do pick up a lot of guns in this game because I wasn't running scavenger so I run out of ammo really short into the game I pick up this random SWAT and I just go ham with it once I get it you'll know it's some random it's kind of like the hybrid or whatever that site is called in this game that kid is just trying to play with his elbows but this gameplay is just short and what I really want to ask you guys is have you guys ever tried multi-team out I know this gameplay is not multi-team so it's kind of ironic that I'm talking about multi-team but I've been playing a lot of multi-team in the last like 24 hours and I'm enjoying it a lot more than I'm ground war in ground war I've had people just ruin lobbies for me just random like people I'll tell you this though there's this one spot on aftermath that annoys the crap out of me there's this one spot where every time I run down like this, and it's like Aftermath is so open except for Beat Om area, so it kind of just sucks in general other than like that area. But when you're like in the, I guess, I don't even know how to describe it, I think it's Seaside. If you're on that side, there's always these snipers that just sit in their scopes and wait on you, and that just really frustrates me. But that, that, that kind of stuff doesn't happen in multi-team because you don't get those big maps, and even if I do, I leave the lobby. The biggest map I'll play in multi-team is Plaza. I really got like a, I didn't get any nuclears in it, I died on a brutal and on two, I think two relentlesses and another brutal, or not a brutal, another ruthless or whatever 15 is, and that was on plaza, I got like, I think it was like 75 and 5-ish kind of score, it was a really, really fast paced game, but I didn't get any nuclears, if I got one I might have uploaded it, because it was with the AN-94, but in general, all I can ask you guys is try out multi-team if you haven't. <coughs> There's like no one in those, that game mode. Uh, again, the same lobbies over and over again. See, there's the nuclear triple spray kind of thing with this weird SWAT. But in general, multi team is a lot, a lot of fun. I really enjoy it. <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry. Still got that cough. But if you guys haven't tried on multi team, do try it out. And yeah, peace out. Bye bye. I love you. Subscribe if you're new still. Yeah.